back to my channel today I'm not doing anything we're still waiting for the house to be ready and to get the keys so basically we don't have anything to do and today Ash went to work for his first time uh, since we got back and we are spending every day together um, since we got back to Australia so I don't really know what to do today I'm thinking to go for a walk maybe to get a coffee something um, down the lake so maybe I will do that um, I just got this package today and I'm gonna open it those are the pens that I've got they're a little bit different than what I already have but they're still super comfortable I think they're from the winter collection so that's why maybe they're like a little bit thicker um, but they're still very very comfortable flexible um, I'm not sure about the print because I'm usually wearing black but I think I'll keep them anyway um, by the way 28 weeks pregnant today this baby doesn't stop moving, I can feel him all day and it drives me crazy. I don't know if it's a good thing or not, um, but I'm gonna ask my doctor at the end of the week. I've got an appointment, so I'll keep you updated on that. <music> So basically we need to go all along the lake all the way until I don't know if you guys can see it but the white stuff there and then we go left and then there's another couple of caves there so stop because I feel like um, little cramps in my belly and I don't want to push it too much um, yeah I can't believe how out of shape I am like we used to run this whole way all the way to the bridge um, where the cafe is like maybe twice a week and come back it's probably like 7k's and I don't know now I feel like I'm already out of breath and it's like only halfway so like I know seven months pregnant and everything but I kind of wish we did more like intensive workout um, the last couple of months with all the things that's going on and everything I could, couldn't really bother to do anything intensive so I guess I'll have to do more when we actually like starting to get back in shape and the baby boards and everything hopefully coming back from the cafe won't be so hard I kind of hope like Ash will call and say oh look we, I like I finished working and you will meet me at the cafe so back walking I had some water I had some rest I feel much better um, I think the baby's now more relaxed as well and yeah there's another maybe two k's until the cafe and then we just can relax get some emails done and yeah just got to the cafe I ordered some coffee and I'm so hot <laughs> Oh my god. I'm a little bit out of breath but I'm almost back home. I did stop at the pharmacy to get more iron and at the grocery store to get a few things for dinner. And yeah, I'll be back home soon. Have a nice shower. Um, and basically waited for us to come back home the lake is so beautiful today i'm so glad i went um for a walk and not just stayed at home although it's like wait i have to show you this how cute are they <laughs> 
Um, as soon as we get the keys and everything, I'm sure I'll be busy with the house cleaning and like decoration and getting ready for the baby and everything. But I really hope I will keep doing something every day. Um, doesn't have to be like, you know, 10Ks walk, but um, even a little walk in the mornings will be great to keep up in being shape. <laughs> he, came, he came back from work and he had a lot of chicken. So now I'm going to have dinner by myself. That's not true. Yeah. What are you having for dinner? Yogurt. Yeah. Oh, look at that, everyone. That's what he had. Great. What am I having? Salad. A Polish device. You know, you know it's, um, it's what I had for breakfast. It's dessert. It's what I had for breakfast. Baby, yep. how was your first day at work? Um, so my first day at work was interesting. Okay. I worked in a freezer, minus 40 degrees, with no protective equipment on, for 30 minutes before someone came out to uh, check on me uh, and then I went into a another freezer which is minus 16 degrees Celsius um, to unload 680 cartons of butter that weighs what? 20 kilos 25 kilos each box now my back hurts my arms hurt. Tomorrow I'm driving the truck. So I'm driving to a place called French's Forest, which is halfway to Canberra from where we are. It's about a three and a half hour drive. That's so not too bad. I will leave here home at 11 o'clock, pick up the truck. And you want to have coffee in the morning, yes. which is like the most important thing. And that will keep me going. I'll yeah. pick up the truck at 11 o'clock. I will get loaded. Very nice. I will leave. Using tissue. I will leave. <laughs> <laughs> I will leave the warehouse, hopefully before one, and hit the road before the traffic starts. Yeah, right. There's traffic all the time. Ouch. Yes. And then I will drive down the highways all the way down to French's Forest, unload, and come back the same night. Yay. Hopefully, Yay. I will see you tomorrow at 9 o'clock. Uh, you'll probably see me just before midnight. <gasps> Seriously? Seriously. Oh, 12 hours. No. That's not fun, Booba. That's why it's better than hand unloading another thousand boxes of butter yes but not fun what i'm gonna do all day tomorrow i can't walk another 10ks it was too hard hmm? it was too hard today walking 10ks by hard. myself i was so bored without you okay anyway got some veggies, I'm gonna make a salad, I got us some chicken, but he's not gonna have it, great, and...
is ready. Um, kind of burn the kitchen down, but that's all right. Uh, if you guys like this video, don't forget to like it and give it a thumbs up. It really supports my channel. Don't forget to subscribe as well. And thank you for watching. I'll see you guys on my next vlog.